COVID-19 crackdown happening in Las Vegas. A Metro is shutting down businesses currently ignoring the governor's orders to close. And 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels right now is live at Jones and Flamingo with a business well known to Channel 13 viewers. Joe. Yeah, Todd, the Nevada Coin Mart is closed. Las Vegas Police and Clark County Authority showed up here over the weekend saying it is not an essential business and closed its doors. The owner, Neil, begs to differ. The Nevada Coin Mart on the corner of Jones and Flamingo closed for business. Known for buying gold, silver, diamonds, Rolexes, and also costume jewelry. And when times get really tough, that's what a lot of people have because they're digging into everything they have to sell. Owner Neil Sackmary is a longtime KTNV advertiser and has made more than 2,000 paid appearances on the KTNV program, The Morning Blend. Neil says authorities came knocking over the weekend. They suspended my business license until April the 16th. As well, they uh, said that we had to close the doors immediately to the general public. Neil says it boils down to the types of businesses that are exempt from the governor's mandatory business shutdown and the types of licenses they have. Most people don't know the difference between a pawn shop and a secondhand dealer. So they naturally assume that a pawn shop is what we have. And so there is a pawn license and there is a second hand license. And so all that needs to be done, and we're not going to open until that point, that the governor would just say pawn shops and second hand dealers. Thank you for calling Max Pawn. This is Shauna. May I help you? Over at Max Pawn, they are allowed to stay open and business is booming. The industry is considered essential because it makes loans to customers. It was interesting, you know, the first week it, it kind of had a little steady flow of business and as of today it's like off the chart. I, can, I feel like people have now are into week two, paycheck isn't there and people are really desperate. Michael Mack is the owner of Max Pond and a longtime friend of Neil's. He was shocked by the forced shutdown of Nevada Coin Mart. And he asked me what I thought and I said, you're an essential business. People come to you every day. They need cash. 13 investigates reached out to Clark County and to Las Vegas police. Authorities confirmed Nevada Coin Mart does not possess a pawn shop license or a banking license and was told to close up. Las Vegas police say they have visited 113 businesses and handed out citations for those defying the order and suspended seven business licenses so far. And Neil says his attorney believes that the Nevada Coin Mart is a financial institution based on a definition from the federal government. Now, we asked the governor's office about clarification about the situation, but we have not heard back. Reporting live, Joe Bartels, 13 Action News. All right, Joe, thank you for that.